Hi guys, welcome back to Chamber of Chess. Today I'm going to show you a study by Ine Kantarovic in 1952. Here, White's goal is to promote our pawn and at the same time ensure that White doesn't get perpetually checked by Black. And perpetual check means that one side, like in this case, just keeps checking you and you cannot escape. So first move is pretty easy. Rook h8, g1. Now if we go straight for promotion, then here there is no block because we lose the rook, and if not, then white just gets under perpetual check, and it's very hard to trick black here and to make a mistake. So king g1 and rook h1. By luring black king to a very bad square, then we promote, and now it's a threat of counter checks, what actually happens in case of queen d3, King f2, check, uh, something like this, or queen f1, counter check, and black king is just in a very bad place here. Alternative option, queen c2, but even then, counter check, and like this. So, black has to make the only practical move, king g1, or even king h2, but then kind of similar thing. So king g1, check, 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 and black simply gets checkmated right here. Alternative option was king h2 and queen g2, same. That's it, guys. Subscribe, write your comments under the video, like, and let me know what you think, and we'll see you next time.